fashion. Yeah, mm -hmm. just kind of move it up close and give them a second or two to clear right. out and then right. kind of, yeah. Okay. Need all them yeah, this one's blood, this one's grown very well. I was very pleased with its progress. Not a lot of holes and There you go, you're flipping her around like a pro now. <laughs> yeah, don't be afraid to turn it upside down and do whatever you've got to look down and, you know, when you see this and then see Pearl, then start yeah. working out till you find eggs. Okay. Okay, and that way you know, okay, she's been there. I'm seeing the pearl. You're seeing there. the pearl and then you're moving out, you'll start seeing smaller and smaller and smaller until you see eggs. She's got some real little tiny larvae in there. It's only about four days old. If you look, there's a little bit bigger cell size right here. Okay. Okay, do you see that comparison? Yeah. There's it's really not prevalent on this one. But that's the drone you know, they actually drone cells are bigger. Okay. Okay. Where they have drone brood. Okay. Now what we can do here is we can leave her out on this side. Okay. Okay, so I would put her back in and slide it this direction and try to get her to get over here and lay eggs on these frames. Oh, because we want her to... We want her to expand that brood chamber. So we, we want to push it that, that way? way. Mm -hmm. okay. Yep. Yep. Nice and gentle. Now, does it? do they have to touch or...? They don't have to touch, no. Okay. 